still off the carbs. I was just curious if you happened to look into the nature of the world. Oh, I did. oh well, that's all right. You still got time. Yeah. Yeah. That's the rest of your life to check it out. He got a card last week, but oh, good. he hasn't quite no, taken that step. Yeah, it's pretty scary, you know. Most people are pretty comfortable on the spinning ball. <laughs> Have a great day. You too. Uh -huh. Perfect. And now I think six bucks, right? Oh, it's six. I, I, yeah. I was thinking five or six. Yeah, two. Two, twos, twos have a way of doing that to a guy. I need to finish my coffee. That too. <laughs> so, did you ever check out the shape of the world you live in? Heck yeah, it's pretty chippy, man. Yeah, she probably knows more about it than I do. It's definitely interesting. I don't. I sat and watched videos too for a while. Right on. Fascinating. Yeah, my, most people are afraid to take a look at the world they live in. I'm glad you, glad you checked it out. All right. Yeah, stay after it. I stay in nature as best as I can. Have a good day. Cheers. Have a great day. Good morning. There you go, brother. Um, and we're giving free one, so have an extra one. Oh, thank you. There's just an abundance this week. Have you ever heard that the Earth is flat? Uh, I have heard that, yeah. You yeah. have? Is it a disc? Here's some information that you might want to check out. We're not There's sure more what, on the back. We're not sure what it is, but we know we don't live on a spinning ball with bendy water stuck to it. A lot of people are afraid to take a look, but... A cylinder, I, you think? Uh, we're thinking well, more of a disc. You know, water takes the shape of its container, and allegedly there's ice walls encircling the, the yeah, plane yeah. that we seem to live on, you know, with the sun and moon circling overhead and the stars and all that, so... And no, nothing you've been told is true, so that, that may help open your eyes to the realm we live in. Cool. NASA is Please, a government uh, agency that's paid $20 billion a year to fake outer space. going to space. Control. $20 billion a year, you know, that could A lot easier to control people if they think they're living on a, a finite uh, environment. As opposed to an endless plane. And you don't know you're missing, I guess. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Have Thanks, a good day. Brother. Have you ever considered uh, the shape of the world that you live on? That, that, that the earth might be flat? Have you heard anything about that? Um, he gave me a card last week. Oh, oh did you I? Did? Yeah. Oh, I thought I didn't. All right. Okay, I got seven of these suckers this time. Seven of them? Yeah. Okay, that'll be eleven fifty. Hey, this guy, he looks like he needs he needs a card. Hello. Hi, can I give you one of these? Sure. Have you ever considered the nature of the reality that we live in? That the earth might not be a spinning ball? Yeah. Have you seen anything about that on the internet? Um, I don't know if I have or not. Simple horizon test. Is this like a business card or? No, it's just no. Uh, just some information. There's oh, okay. some more information on the back. All right. You know how uh, water always seeks its level. That's what we experience, right? Did you ever wonder how it sticks to a spinning ball flying through space? No. Maybe it's time you had. Yeah. <laughs> you know when you look at the horizon, like out over the ocean, and it 
It appears to be level. Probably not. Is that right? No. <laughs> Have you ever been on an airplane? I just got off of an airplane last week. Oh, yeah? Did you look out the window? Uh, I didn't have a window seat, so... Oh. Well, next time you're on an airplane, as you're taking off, notice that the ground rises to your eye level and always remains at your eye level no matter how high you ascend. If you're on a ball, you as you rose up, you'd be looking down at that ball. It would curve down and away from you, but the horizon always rises up to your eye level no matter how high okay. you go. The balloon's 20 miles up, the horizon rises right up to eye level. You don't live on a spinning ball. They've been Essentially, lying. the government's lying to you. Yeah. And uh, NASA gets about $20 billion a year to fake going to outer space. No one ever went to the moon, or no one's ever left the, uh, yeah. this realm. <laughs> In fact, no one's ever gone more than about 120,000 feet above this ground. Yeah, check out those websites. They're pretty interesting. All right. Yeah, okay. lots of think. information there. Uh -huh. All right, thanks. Thank uh -huh. you.